welcome back to my channel I hope you're all doing well I'm sorry it's been a while since I've recorded anything for you um, we were away uh, we went away to France for a week which was absolutely lovely so nice to get away for a bit um, and then I came home and my daughter accidentally knocked my camera off my desk and it broke um, so I've been without camera for a few days this is the new camera I'm back up and running fingers crossed so I thought I'd just do a maybe a, a quick timed piece for you today that way I can um, I can get video up there for you but also I can test my camera out at the same time and we'll see how it goes so I've got my little my little tiny journal today um, I've opened it up to this page I've got this nice bit of eco dyeing that's already there um, so I'm probably not going to do too much of that page, I quite like it as it is, but we'll see how we go. I think I'll give myself 10 minutes for this one. So I'm just going to find that on my timer. Oh, timer. Um, and we'll go to 10 minutes. Like so and um we'll just go for it we'll see what happens okay let's go right so i'm gonna start off with some collage in my usual fashion <clears throat> not much time for any thinking involved um, but that's how i like to work <clears throat> so if you're new to my channel hello and welcome nice to have you here um, and <laughs> you'll soon see that my style is very um, grungy and random I guess so I just kind of do what feels good I don't overthink about it too much just stick things down and see where the page takes me so this is masking, just plain old masking tape that I'm using just to add a little bit of texture in there. And I'm grabbing some matte medium here, my little spreader, and just going to stick down um, those bits that I just randomly picked out from my stash there. Some of these bits are a little thick, so I might need a bit of stronger glue to get, hold them down, but we'll see how we go got a little bit of tissue paper here that I've made some marks on so I'm gonna have that spreading on so I'm gonna have things like spreading on to this uh, eco dyed page but I'm not gonna um, I'm not gonna cover it just a few little pinky marks that creates on there and I like this bit because I've got a little bit of pink in there as well I'm gonna use that's quite thick so I'm gonna use some stronger glue oops sticking to me <clears throat> on eight minutes already left there we go I'm just gonna stick that there and then um, whilst I'm here I think I'm gonna grab some um, thing out of my fabric box and we'll slap some of that down as well a bit of flowers I like that because it's got a little bit of the pink in and some plain Maybe a bit, a bit of that as well. Let's see how that goes. I've got the Fabri-Tac out, so I could sew this on. Sewing it would be quite nice, but we've not got time for that today. So let's just stick it down and see what happens. Oop. So I hope you've all been having. Well, I'd say summer wherever you are <laughs> it might not be summer where you are um, it's the start of summer here and um, well the kids are still at school till uh, end of July but we've got lovely warm weather here at the moment um, so I've really been enjoying that spending plenty of time working in the garden which has just been absolute bliss I've just got some gesso now Ooh, I like those loose threads, but I'm just going to add a little bit of here, gesso here and there. <clears throat> I 
And we were very lucky with the weather we had in France as well. It was, again, glorious weather. Beautiful, sort of 28 degrees Celsius every day. Oh, gorgeous. And I, um, we did lots of walking. We went to Paris for the day, had a wander around. Took, so the kids, that's the first time the kids have been to Paris. Or for my youngest, actually, the first time she's ever been to a capital city. So that she was really excited. That was nice. Okay, that's a little bit of gesso there. I'm going to quickly dry that. So I'll be back in a second. Right, that's uh, that's dry-ish. I've um, got five minutes left. I happen to have my Neo colours just on my desk, so I'm going to use some of those to add some colour. So I'm just going to randomly scribble some of those on. What should we go for? Got let's stick with some of that pink because we've got that there. Just a little. I'm just going to use some water on my brush just to activate those, move them about a bit. A little bit of yellow into that <clears throat> eco dyed paper. Um, let's throw in, I've got a little bit of coffee on my desk as well. Just adding water to just, because um, it's all dried out, sorry, so I'll just add some of that in. Okay, so there's colour, now we just need an image of some kind. I've got this old film review book and I'm just going to very quickly pull out an image that we can use. Uh, no time, no time, no time. We'll go for that one. I'm just um, usually would cut this, but no time for that, so I'm just going to tear it. Should we just cut down that white bit off? Maybe chop a her off, and she's going to sit. Where's she going to sit? Nope, yep, I, I need to trim that black off. That black's not working for me. So just giving her a quick trim around. That's better. That suits that's better. That goes uh just sits better with me with the colours that I've got that I'm working with. So that's her, and then some words. I've got oh, that's randomly on my desk that says within her. Let's see if we can see if we could find anything else. In this is just a, some uh, some words that I keep uh, when I just I'm, I pick words out, but I don't end up using them. I shove them in here, so you can find some random random things. Oh quite like that a wonderful piece within her there we go <clears throat> two minutes let's get this down Oop. putting that over here a wonderful Sticking to me, sticking to me. Peace. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Within her. And I think we just need a little bit of contrast. So I'm going to grab. <clears throat> this is my um, graphite Lyris pen, water soluble graphite. I'm just going to grab some on the paintbrush here and just add a little bit of dark. I know I, I know I cut that dark off and now I'm adding dark in and it doesn't make much sense. But I think it just needs something to make her pop a little bit. I've 
I'll do a few little flicks with this as well. Ooh, all over a face. Tissue, tissue, tissue. Lift that out. 30 seconds, let's just trim that off a little bit. And um, last tiny 20 seconds. Get my dresser back out, a bit more white space. There we go. So, oh, shush. Ah, why won't you be quiet? Go away. Silence. There we go. Sorry about that. Right. So that, not the best page I've ever done in the world, but still, I might, uh, I might just tweak a little bit. Let's have a look. I think all it needs really is because I'm annoyed that I splashed, I splashed her with that graphite. What's daft thing to do? So I'm going to just cheat a little bit and just finish off by just re-whiting out her habit with a little bit of gesso. It looks like she's wearing a weird hat. Oh dear. Hmm. I'm going to quickly dry it and then I'll show you, I'll hold it up so you can see it a bit clearer. Right, I'm back. I dried it. Um, I still wasn't happy with the with the nun here. She's she wasn't she wasn't popping enough. So I've just gone round with a, some geo color in pink, just to uh, highlight her a little bit. But all in all, a page in about ten minutes, we'll say. And I'll just hold that up so you can see that a little bit clearer. Ooh. There we go. So oh, that's it for today. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you again soon. Take care. Bye.